señor Fielding. This is Colonel Díaz, a Lieutenant Arroyo. Señor Fielding, may I say what a great pleasure is to entertain an American intellectual, somebody with whom I can exchange contemporary political ideas and, and opinions. I brought you some cake. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, these are prunes. I like cherry. Oh, they, they don't make cherry on uh, Tuesday. Señor Fielding, dinner is served. Would you please? Maybe some poison in my food, but I am okay. I have been poisoned so many times, I have developed an immunity. You're not tense, are you? Tense? No. Dinner was delicious. Thank you, sir. Check, sir. Thank you. Uh, who had the roast beef? I have. It's 12, 16. Who had the corned beef and cabbage here? That was mine. I don't understand something. There's two roast beefs on here. Who, what did you have? Chili con carne. Chili con carne. Well, there's two roast beefs. There's an extra roast beef. Well, I have only one roast beef. There, well, here. There's, a, there's, a, there's one chili. There's two roast beefs. But who beefs has the chili? I have the, the chili. Well, then, then, then. I don't. You want uh, Diners Club? You have uh, Bank of America? Uh, yes. All yes. right. There you go. Here. Okay. Let's go to the salon for brandy. Can you keep it down? I'm getting a headache. And so, I want to do only what is right for my people. That is to, to protect them from communism. I am sure you understand that. Yes, but Esposito and his rebels are not communists. They are communists! Well, I think I know a little bit about politics. Get up. Get up. Right. Excuse me. If I give a better life to my people, I have to exterminate a few troublemakers. That's the price we pay. I gotta be going. It's late for me. It has been a real pleasure to have this little chat with you. Thank you. Viva San Marcos! Viva! Viva! Viva. He is perfect. I could kill him now. He brings cake for a group of people. He doesn't even bring an assortment. You cannot forget that. No, no. We'll kill him as planned, dressed as rebels. Then an outraged United States will see how bloodthirsty beasts Esposito and his men are, and we'll get all the support we need. When can our men get the rebel uniforms? I spoke with the tailors. He's going on vacation, and then he needs three days for the alterations. Too long. We'll, we'll get another tailor now. But he does such nice work. Take a look at his jacket. It was much too big. He took it in for me. And he doesn't even charge much. No, no, no. We get another tailor. I want it to look like the rebels kill him not later than tomorrow afternoon. <laughs> 